If you want to update your kitchen on a budget, you may consider refacing. But before you make that decision, you want to make sure you consult an expert. And we have a WBOC Delmarva expert, Mike Donahue, with Kitchen Concepts, who incidentally installed the Delmarva Life Studio Kitchen. Hi, Mike. Hi, how are you? Good. Now, first, let's talk about refacing. What is the process? What is it? Well, refacing is actually where we take an old cabinet and we make it look new. Mm -hmm. And I brought an example as sort of a mock-up of uh, an old oak cabinet that we actually turned into what looks like a new cherry cabinet. Uh, but refacing is where you replace the door, uh, obviously on the cabinet. You take a veneer product, uh, which is comes in sheets and you cut it down and you actually apply it to the face of the cabinet and also to the sides. So what you're doing is you're covering the old, and you can see here this old pickled oak, uh, which was probably you know popular you know 10 or 15 years ago, and you're covering it with a much more updated cherry look. Mm -hmm. And you can have different looks, right? With oh, the absolutely. Veneers? Yeah, uh -huh. all the wood species, different stains, so there's tons and tons of options. All right, now we're in a kitchen that you're getting ready to reface, and you say this kitchen is a perfect candidate for refacing. Why is that? Well, the homeowner in this case wants to keep their, their existing layout in the, in the kitchen, so they want to keep all the cabinets the same. Um, they also have really uh, pretty good cabinets that have, have tested, uh, lasted pretty well over the years, they've taken good care of them. So structurally, from the interiors to the faces, they're in good shape. So they will actually take the product very well. Um, also, uh, this particular homeowner had recently installed stone countertops. Um, we want to try not disrupt the tops. Uh, whenever you move granite or, or some of the man-made stones, you always risk some type of damage. And so we want to leave those in place so we don't have that risk. Uh, additionally, uh, they want to keep all of their appliances in the same locations. Uh, the flooring they want to keep the same. So really, in this case, uh, it's just a kind of a perfect example of what would where refacing makes sense. Okay, and not all kitchens are created equal. We have kitchens that are not a good candidate for refacing. Tell us about that. Well, anytime that you've got any kind of damage uh, to the existing cabinets, whether it's in the structure or in the face frames, uh, that's a, a bad case, um, a, a bad example of, of an of a opportunity for refacing. Um, also, if you want to change any of the layout, if you want to expand things or if you want to uh, add function in some of the cabinets, the more you're going to be doing, the more work you're going to do on site, the more expensive it gets. And there's actually sort of a point where the refacing starts to become more expensive than it is to actually replace everything with brand new cabinets. Mm -hmm. And so that's kind of where you have a discussion with the homeowner and there's some decisions to be made and what makes the most sense. And that might be the case if you're looking into using a big national chain to come in and refi or reface your kitchen. Right, right. There's, there's some brands out there that actually um, advertise and it's a it's kind of a high pressure in-home sale, uh, tend to be high commission. So uh, they're really offering a product that they're really forcing uh, to, you know, to fit every mold. And like I said before, not every kitchen's a good candidate. So really, if you kind of educate yourself about the options uh, and you find somebody that you can talk to about that, you're really going to figure out what's best for you and fits your budget and what you're trying to do in your house. And possibly save a lot of money. Absolutely. All right. So the bottom line is find yourself an expert if you're looking to remodel your kitchen. Hey, we have one right here, Mike Donahue with Kitchen Concepts. And if you would like to learn more about refacing or kitchen concepts, just log on to our website, delmarvalife.com. Click on the show tab. Still to come on Delmarva Life, I get one of these. We're in the kitchen with cake art. We're going to learn how to decorate a cake. Simple steps that you can take in your own kitchen to make a masterpiece. Delmarva Life, life at its best here on Delmarva.